Who do you think Sarge is going to play? Because he has a smorgasbord. Oh, I actually expected it. I would, he very rarely goes Mewtwo round game one. Yeah. And I'm very more surprised that no one reset the score. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> it's very rare for him to go Mewtwo round one. It's usually the round two pick if he goes wrong round one. Yeah, we'll see how this goes. Huh? He, he might be going very for real here this time around. I feel like most of the times he's practicing, he's practicing Mewtwo. Yeah. That worked out. Okay. I, I will say, I know oh. for sure Sorry Tag has been feeling like he has not been performing as well as before. Mm -hmm. So he might be going in this just headstrong, going solo, solo Mewtwo, maybe Aegis Slash. That oh. Be... oh, that reach. Dang. Yeah, no, this is like, I don't know, there's been a lot of solid stuff going on right here, and we couldn't keep up. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> and George pushing me against the wall. I like it. And fire punch there. Yeah, there is a gap for people to counter. Does that cover almost everything? Is that fire punch? Um, I mean, you can, you can just naturally counter it if we don't have you juggled in the air. Yeah. So, uh, fire punch, yeah, it should cover everything. I, th I think it hits us before we can acrobatics. Oh, uh, wow. Right. Yep, and there's nice, nice helmet. Nice helmet. Yeah, Sartek making a nice amount of pressure, but Fiora does have the burst. Yep, there it is. Oh, he just going in. Okay. He is going very aggro right now. Oh, man, I, I, this is the first time I've seen him go so aggro in a long time. He he, he was starting to like wane off of the aggro play style for a while, to like, be more defensive, but he is just going crazy right now. And forcing those 50 50 guesses. Well, and it, it works for Mewtwo because, you know, it's just Mewtwo being such a solid player, he can create these 50 50 situations pretty easily. Yeah. Exactly. Um, so it's, it's you know, keeping on that pressure puts Mewtwo in a very good situation. Mm -hmm. So I can see why it's working so well. Sorry, I'm going in right now. Excellent. Man, he is just nailing everything right now. Oh, oh, what is this combo? Ah, oh, nice. Okay. Man, Fjord is having a hard time getting out of this situation. Yeah. Oh man, that's hard attack. Seriously, just going absolutely crazy. And Toad gets to get in even more. Oh. All right. When you feel based on Fjord, really a not good situation. Yeah. Oh! Excellent bait there. Didn't, didn't get much off of it. Though. Mm -hmm. Man, okay. Sorry, attack in a very solid game one right there. Yep. I will say though, Fiora is a very good player at bouncing back. I think she has a really good time adapting and learning from matchups. Because I know, like, this where like, if, I get, if I get her something round one, she's always looking for a round two. And you can kind of see that when she baited out the 8Y. Like, she's like, okay, you did that once, not again. Like, well, from my perspective, it's like, what did you honestly get off of that, though? That is like, true. You don't, you're not putting any frame advantage. If it was a sucker punch, it may be a different story. I guess it could also be like sending a message to like to start attack, like, okay, I'm not letting you do this anymore. Like, this isn't gonna work anymore. So it could be a more like uh, I, I hate to like psychological move, but I guess that could be but. here we go, yeah. combo opportunity. I think he missed the uh, the dash and another combo opportunity. What? Um, I'm not sure what she's going for. She could have been going for a lot of damage it wasn't. Oh man, unfortunate. I mean, I can get the idea of like a reset, but I feel like there are better resets than that. She could have done another damage or something like that. I hope Fiora is not getting maybe defeated at this point. I know it can be very demoralizing, but yet it's kind of Mewtwo. Okay. Oh, nice. Very surprised that worked. Very good stuff, I'm sorry, that yep. Fjord does have a tendency to be very counter heavy, and I think Sartag really happens with that and getting those mix up grabs. Fjord needs to start, I think, maybe using more 2 wise defensive tool as well to try and intercept, but it also puts her in a low profile. Nice, I like that. Interesting. Okay. I'm expecting a 2 X there. We got first coming out here. Sorry, I got to try playing a bit more defensive, but. Ah. Okay. Side strike. Alright. Sorry, I'm definitely taking a lot of risks and it's really working out right now. And if you're in. I didn't able to get the burst for the chip either. Nice. Okay. Able to land the counter at least. So we can now. Ah, he jumped. That's. 
Ah, unfortunate. And... Oh, man. Pressure on, though. I like these Okies. Yeah. Oh, man. Sorry, they're kind of slipping a little bit right now. And... I couldn't quite find it, and that's punishable. Alright. She might be able to get her burst here soon. Last guy. She's gonna just duck. She's gonna need to take that. Duck. Oh, and is that no. it? Not yet. She has a burst. She's gonna need to use that. Yeah. Okay. Oh, that's gonna be. Oh. Oh, oh man. Yeah. Sorry, Tag. It'll take it 2-0 over Fiora. Now, it's not a hog. She's doing a lot of things.